What's good, y'all? Before we get into the video, I just want to give a thanks to Everfun for sponsoring today's video. Everfun is an outdoor brand, provides with a series of convenient and efficient insulation coolers. It also has energy efficient technology, and that basically enhances the insulation function. They have different styles, so if you wanted the backpack, the shoulder bag, tote bag, or the hydration pack, they have a whole bunch of variety. The hydration backpack is lightweight. Cool thing about the hydration backpack is that it has hands-free drinking, and it comes with a two-liter water bladder and a bilateral hose outlet. It has a separate insulated bladder compartment and that can last for six hours of cooling with ice packs. So if you're living in Florida like me and it gets hot, hot, and I mean, you don't really have to worry about your drinks getting warm or liter bladder is replaceable just in case something happened to it and it supports up to three liters. It has different pockets. So if you wanted to put your cell phone, wallet, keys, anything, you're good to go. Cooler backpack is another lightweight backpack. Now this one has a lot of storage and that's why I like it a lot too. It has high density insulation material and has a leak proof liner inside of it. And what's crazy man, this is real deal crazy. This backpack can keep food cold for 20 hours. And I pretty much didn't really put food in it, but you actually can. I just ended up putting my, you already know what I gotta have on me 24 seven. I gotta have the coconut water. So I just pretty much packed it up with some coconut water. Didn't really do too much, but it can hold up to 30 cans. So if you wanted to do something else besides the coconut water, it def definitely has a storage to do it. And it's easy to clean too. So it also has a storage up top and it comes with two on the side and a water bottle pocket. And they got the bottle can openers, man. So, <laughs> you know what I mean? It kind of gives a little cool aesthetic to the backpack. If you're hiking or going to the beach, uh, you know, you can be able to carry it. Not really be uncomfortable while you're walking. And like I said, I'm a huge fan of <laughs> coconut water. So, and to be able to have it still cold, even while I'm still in Florida, cause y'all know how the heat get. It, get, it get crazy hot down here. So to be able to have something still cold and that's real deal plus 10. But again, I just want to give a thanks to Everfun for sponsoring today's video. Song. Man, y'all probably looking at it like, dang, you ain't flopped the whole day? Ah, I ain't gonna care. I don't know what I was doing, bro. I got here and I think at like 3.20 I got here. And then after that, I was just chopping it up with them. You know what I'm saying? Pretty much the whole time for real. It's crazy because it feel like I ain't been here in a minute just because like almost every weekend I be coming down here. So like uh, when I first came down here, I'm like, we did, you know what I'm saying? So, you know what I'm saying? Like, you ain't seen somebody in a little minute. Not in a little minute, but we just swapping stories type deal. And then I'm like, dang. I gotta leave in a little, you know what I'm saying, a little minute and then post to go to church, feel cold for. Yeah, I came down here and started talking and stuff and shoot, I look at the time, I'm like, bro, time flies so fast, like it just flew. So right now I'm just about to, uh, what's my call it? I'm about to work out right now. I'm definitely going, uh, tomorrow probably gonna be a longer day. Look, that's how I, man, I keep, I like to keep stuff organized, bro. Like it just be, you know what I'm saying? It make you feel good type deal. So I ain't gonna show you, you know what I'm saying? But it's the notes. And I'm just, you know what I'm saying, Sunday, Monday, woo woo. I like to keep it in my notes, you know what I'm saying, so I can just type it out and stuff like that. But that's beside the point. I just had to show y'all that. That's my fault. I ain't vlogged the whole day. You know what I mean? But, you know what I'm saying? We're going to get better tomorrow. Don't even, you know what I'm saying? Don't need trip. You already know what I'm on. I keep the same routine, everything. So, uh, and as y'all people, I got sliced up today. That make you feel good, too. If you're having a bad day, man. And you just feeling like, dang, ooh, go get a haircut. You know what I'm saying? They're the new me. I'm really just going on a rant. It's probably because I ain't talked to y'all in a minute for real. Last vlog, I ain't talking, you know I'm saying, the whole time. But I, I kind of wanted it that way, man. It was peaceful. I ain't going to care to me. If you ain't, you know what I'm saying, seen that, more, definitely go check it out. And I won't say that on no videos, but 
You know what I'm saying? Like, it just it just felt like a movie for real. Just because, like, that's what it really be like. You know what I'm saying? I think everybody who live alone and stuff, like, it's honest what it be like. And it just be, for me, it's peaceful, right? You know what I'm saying? That's that, that's just me. You know what I'm saying? It's peaceful. You know what I'm saying? You understand yourself more. You love yourself. And, yeah, like, living alone, it, it got its pros, for sure. You know what I'm saying? It got cons, too. But I want to say, like, I really feel lonely, for real, only because, like, when I was in Atlanta and college and other spots, like, I was always around people, so this really like my first time where I was really like, like I'm really dope, like I'm really by myself. So I know y'all probably see it a different way because, you know what I'm saying, that's what social media be portraying sometimes type deal. Not saying it in a bad way, but you know what I mean? Like sometimes you don't know the full story on social media type of So that's why I be letting y'all in to kind of know the real, you know what I'm saying, the real deal. And it is really my first time where I get to, I'm saying be dolo and stuff like that and I'm actually like glad I you know I'm saying I'm doing it just because like it's peaceful too and it's separation you know what I'm saying especially when I meet in my journey getting closer to God and stuff and you know what I'm saying learning how he worked and just learning myself learning what I need to work on to build my character need to work on this need to work on this and a lot of stuff along the way when you're on the you know what I'm saying the journey with God it's a lot of stuff that a lot of baggage that you know what I'm saying I even had a lot of people had where it's like you just he trying to chop it off, you know what I'm saying? Even myself, I wasn't even trying to let him chop it off. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? A lot of a lot of stuff that I, I had built up, you know what I'm saying, over time and stuff. So, uh, shoot, you know what I mean? That's what the journey, bro, is working on it. You know what I mean? Like, thing with me being like by myself and stuff, I had to come correct that. Ain't nothing finna be perfect, you know what I'm saying? Like, when you waiting for it to be perfect, waiting this time to be perfect, or I'm gonna do this when I get perfect, it just don't, it ain't never finna work like that. So that's what I'm learning too. And I'm learning not to be, you know what I'm saying, so hard on myself too. I think I was a, a person who, you know what I'm saying, always wanted to have perfection. And I'm, I'm slowly getting out that mode and just taking a deep breath and like, man, it ain't gonna never go that way. Like, it ain't never gonna go that way. You ain't never gonna be perfect. Only per perfect person and you already know who. And he upstairs, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah, that's what I'm learning right now. And I just wanted to, yeah, let y'all know, man, because that's really what, you know what I'm saying, really been... You know what I'm saying? Popping in my head, you know what I mean? Trying to <laughs> be so perfect, but it, I, I, I mean, kind of understanding this whole summer that it just ain't never going, you know what I'm saying? Never going to be like that, too. You know what I mean? And, uh, yeah, that pretty much what's going on, man. So, yeah. <laughs>
Christmas is coming. Start sending your letters off to Santa. is coming Staying up late looking out the window cool off a little bit that's one thing i don't like i guess i don't really like i don't really check up on too much like i feel like it take a lot of time during the day and it's like i'm saying i feel like we be stressing ourselves like oh we gotta i'm saying eat this many times in a day or do this do this do that and it's bro it's like you know what i'm saying even if you do and i'm just speaking from you know what i'm saying my opinion i know everybody you know what i'm saying got their own opinion type deal but like my opinion, bro. Honestly, bro, I, like I ain't really even like really count really calories like that for real, for real. Like I know when I get hungry and then I'ma eat, and I know when I'm you know what I'm saying really not that hungry. So it's like, and I would prefer like if I had a choice like for real, for real, I'll do one meal a day. And like during the, the first part of the day, I'll be doing a lot of you know what I'm saying make sure I get all my stuff. That's why I feel like it's like you need herbs and stuff. You know what I'm saying all your minerals and vitamins and stuff. So. You know what I mean? Like, definitely, like, get that, you know what I'm saying, and during the day or in the morning or whatever, get that out the way. But during the day, bro, I honestly would be doing, like, you know what I'm saying, coconut water, fruits, smoothies. Shoot, like, for half of the, you know what I'm saying, the whole day for real, for real. And then at the end, I'll just do, like, a, like I'm doing now, like, a big meal, you know what I'm saying, and work out during the day. And I'll really be straight, bro. I don't, my mind, like, I'm more so, like, you feel me? Like, I want to, you know what I mean, have that superhero body, but I ain't really, like, stressing, like, trying to be, I'm saying, big, like, you know what I mean? Yeah, man, I really just, you know what I mean, move through the day. When I get hungry, I get hungry. You know what I'm saying? And I'm going to eat. You feel me? And then pretty much will be going on, too. So, and uh, today I ain't really do too much for for. I just pretty much like, oh, no, I actually did. Uh, this morning I had a, uh, that's what really been going on this month, dog. I really been searching for apartments or whatever. And the other day I went to see, uh, uh, you know what I'm saying, some apartments in the city. And I ain't really like, I was like wishy-washy about it. I ain't really like it too much, like. I don't know, bro. I ain't really like a city dude. Like, I like the city a lot. Like, I like the city. Like, I guess it depends where I'm at. Like, if I'm in the city, I want to be a little bit far away from the city, but, you know what I'm saying, close enough where I can, you know what I mean, go back and, you know what I'm saying, be on my own timing. But for the most part, like, you know what I mean, I like to be in that area. It's not even, like, away from people. I don't get, I don't want y'all to get that twisted, bro. I, I feel like a lot of people probably look at my, not, nah, well, y'all, I don't know, which, I can't, you know what I'm saying, say what y'all think, you know what I'm saying, so, but I feel like, uh, you know what I mean, I think when people be seeing people alone, they be like, oh my gosh, you don't got no friends, or you feel me, it don't even be on that type of time, it's just, you feel me, it's just like what I like to do, like, you know what I'm saying, I like to kick it, I like to, you know what I mean, go out of my own time, and like, I like to go do stuff on my own time, and I guess, like, you know what I mean? If like living wise and stuff, I like to have an area of like, you know what I mean? If I get a bike or something, I can just bike around. Like, you know what I'm saying? If I just want to walk, I can just walk around. You know what I'm saying? Be able to see, like work out outside. Like it's a lot of stuff I like to be able to do. You know what I mean? And again, y'all already know what's happening. I'm from the country. Like I got a country family. So I got it in my, you know what I'm saying? I got it in my blood type deal. So, you know what I mean? I like to be close enough to the city, like I said, but far enough where I can, you know what I mean? For the most part, bro, I was looking at like a lot of like, high rise apartments and stuff like that and I was just looking I'm like eh you know what I'm saying like it wasn't really like dang it's far you know what I mean it wasn't you know on that type of time and I ain't saying I would never move you know what I'm saying to the high rise thing but or like that type of timing but 
for the most part, bro, like on my mind, I was just like, man, I just, I just like being, not even out the way, I just like to have space. Like I like to have like a, I go outside and I see grass, you feel me? Like this morning, I just was searching for apartments. And I mean, I found this fire apartment. I ain't gonna lie, fire. You know what I mean? And yeah, I really was decided on that. That's pretty much what I was doing in the morning, honestly. And then, uh, like I said, you know what I'm saying? I did, uh, I got some groceries and stuff. And then that was pretty much it. I came back to the crib and yeah, bro. You know what I'm saying? I kind of just been, you know what I mean? I ain't really been like no sad, you know what I'm saying? No sad and nothing or nothing like that. I know y'all probably like, dang, where Phil been or this and that. It really ain't even been on that type of timing. But like I told y'all yesterday, you know what I'm saying? I feel like perfectionist is something that, you know what I mean? I feel like I got to deal with. You know what I'm saying? Look myself in the mirror type deal and be like, bro, it's okay, bro. You know what I'm saying? It's okay. You don't got to do all the way to the, you don't got to have it all the way to a T. You know what I'm saying? It's okay. And that's why I'm, I got to get real with myself. And I don't know if anybody deal with that's on his channel or whatever, bro. Like, that's something that, you know what I mean? God's still working on me. He working on a lot, you know what I'm saying, with my heart. And that's why. Every time I be praying, man, I be asking him just for me to get my heart right. You know what I mean? It's like that. I'm talking about the all the way around. And that's the, like, the, I'm telling you, bro, like, I'm telling you, dog, like, that's the, like, having your heart right, bro, and having your, you know what I'm saying, your mind right is better than having all the, the Louis Vuitton, better than having all the, the shoes, you know what I'm saying? It's better than having all the cars, the Teslas, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's cool, you feel me? Like, I ain't, I'm a, bro, and that's coming from me. I don't, like, I love stuff. Like, I love high quality stuff. I love fashion. I love that stuff. You know what I'm saying? But like, yeah, I, I love it. So I ain't gonna sit here and lie to y'all like that. But like, I'm telling y'all that when you just be like, you love it, but at the same time, you know what it is. Like, you know what I mean? You know who created everything. You know who is the creator of gold. You know who the creator of money. You, if you know like the creator of all that and that's God, bro, it's like, Man, you, it's like you ain't really worrying about this stuff. Like, you, you want to have it and stuff, but at the same time, it's like, shoot, I'm, I'm content. Like, you know what I mean? I, God, I thank you for where I'm at right now. I'm not saying God want us to just be, you know what I'm saying, flat out broke or flat out not having money and stuff. That's not the way God want us to live. And that's, I'm being a, honestly true. I don't care nobody say God ain't want us to just, you know what I'm saying? That's how a lot of things our God blesses us. God blesses us, us in a lot of ways. And I feel like some people think like, I guess God wants us to, oh, no, nah, I got to be so humble that I can't spend money. Or I got to be so humble that, nah, God, I'm going to just, you know what I mean? Like, I I, I can't have this. No, nah, I can't. Nah, God ain't, you know what I mean? I ain't telling God just telling you to go spend money, do whoop, whoop, this and that. But, you know what I'm saying? God know the desires of your heart, too. You know what I mean? And it's like, God trying to bless you with it. Why would you tell God no? You know what I'm saying? And I'm not, I'm not speaking in the sense of, like, you know what I mean? God just... Telling, you know what I'm saying, telling me to go buy a Louis Vuitton or God tell me to go, he tell me to go buy these other things. But I'm just saying like in a, a like a, as a whole, bro, God just don't want us to just be here, like be, you know what I'm saying, sad and not have money on earth. Like, like you got to have money to like go around this, this, this crib on earth. You got to have money to do stuff. You know what I'm saying? You got to have money. You got to have money to travel. You gotta have money to. You gotta have money to pay bills. You gotta have money to. You know what I mean? Give. You gotta have money to help people out. You gotta have money to do all these things. So, it's like for the people that's like, and this ain't no shots or nothing. Y'all already know it's all love on my channel, man. Y'all already, even if y'all don't agree with me, man, I'm still gonna shake y'all hand and show y'all love. Cause at the same time, everybody got different minds. Everybody got different thoughts. You know what I'm saying? So everybody not gonna agree on the same thing. But it's just in my opinion. But uh, yeah, bro, it's like God, God want the best for us too. You know what I'm saying? He don't want to just have you just flat out broke. He don't want to just you're walking around sad and stuff. And like, no, God, I don't, I don't want this stuff. I don't, I don't want this stuff. I'm just gonna be humble and be content where I'm at, and live in the mountains and just fast for 190. Like, no, one of the things that sat with me and it keeps me going is my mom used to always tell me. My mom was a like, a, my, I wish I like really. I, that one of the things, bro, I wish my mom was here right now, bro, because I'll be bringing her on this YouTube and just just letting y'all see like see her heart, bro, and just stuff behind it, bro, because she built me up, and it, it, it pisses me off. And I, <laughs> excuse me if that's a, you know what I'm saying, a cuss word. I don't know if that is or not, but, uh, yeah, it just makes me mad, bro, it's because how, like, when she was here, I ain't really, like, I guess kind of listen, like listen how she was, you know what I mean, trying to teach me how, about God. Like I ain't really sit down and listen. So like stuff like that really irks me. That I, I, I'll probably say it kind of irks me. Like, man, why ain't you just listen? But I know God God ain't beat me up, so I can't. I had to. It took me a long time. I ain't going to cap, bro. It took me a long time to kind of like, man, you, like, 
And that's where perfection come in. It's like, dang, I wish I could have did this. Like, oh, mom, I, I apologize, I ain't do this. Or dad, I apologize, I ain't do this, man. Like, and you just gotta, you know what I mean, come to the come to the right spot and be like, man, she's still like, to this day, which, you, which, you know what I'm saying, well, she still love me. And I'll be like, man, heck yeah, but she loved me through thick and thin. It didn't matter what I did, what I did wrong, she still was like, you know what I'm saying, love me through everything, even my pops and stuff. And it's like, imagine, I be thinking like, imagine how much God loved me. You know what I'm saying, and that's what she will always say. But like I said, my mom used to always tell me like, whatever the, because bro, we was in like I told y'all all the time, like we was we was in the, uh, you know what I'm saying. My mom and my dad was in the hospital a lot, in and out the hospital, going back and forth, going back and forth. And my mom used to always say like, whatever the devil stole, he gonna have to give back sevenfold. She used to say that all the time, like whatever the devil stole, he gonna have to give back sevenfold. Back then I ain't really, you know what I'm saying. I'm just like, eh. like okay, you know what I'm saying, and. Again, that hurts me that I was on that type of time, and well, like my mindset was like that, but uh, just worldly thinking, honestly, not spiritual thinking like how she was, godly thinking. And yo, bro, she used to say that a lot, and now I'm kind of I'm kind of realizing all this stuff. Like I'm realizing that <laughs> I'm in the sevenfold right now. Like <laughs> God's been going above and beyond, and it's like He's just it's implying every time, even if I messed up right here, even if I made a might have bought something right here, and I'm like, dang, I knew I shouldn't have bought that. Like I knew I should have, you know, what I'm saying waited, or I was impatient, or it's like things I gotta work on. But it's like God still, like He's still coming and He's supplying like every time. Like it's like, dang, bro, like, I'd have messed up so many times. You still coming back? Like nah, it's not the way. Like you know, what I'm saying do it this way. Like you know, what I'm saying, and that's where it's like. I'm still coming to, like, I'm still trying to realize, like, this man, like, love for us. Not even just me. Everybody who watching this video or the love that he had for y'all. I'm saying, and, like, once we try to, like, we never going to wrap our head around it. But once you, have, like, right, wrap it around just a little bit, it kind of blow your mind, bro. And, like, I can only speak for myself. Like, I used to, even on this, bro, and this, I got to understand, this coming from me, bro. I don't think folks used to, like, understand, bro. I ain't really... Like, I knew God, like, I knew about God, but I ain't really talk about God like that because I always thought God was just like a, in words, like, you know what I'm saying, motivational quote. I guess it's like a motivational thing, so I kind of looked at that. And not, like, I guess I was like, you know what I mean, back and forth. I knew about God. I ain't really like, dang, like, God really, real did real. But it's like the things that, you know what I'm saying, that added up where you got to just like, sometime in point, I'll tell y'all my testimony, but just things up, I'll be like, what in the world like and i'm talking about and it's deep though it's like on the spiritual you know what i'm saying a lot, a lot of people may not be spiritual but i'm talking about on the spiritual aspect like through you know what i'm saying dreams through this through that like it's so much stuff where i i have to like i'll sit back and be like i can't even be like bro that's nothing but god you know what i'm saying i couldn't even say oh no nah, i did the cal like the calculation right here no i did this right here that's what made it nah i was like nah what in the world so that had me like seeking him for real like is he real and i got to a point that i was really seeking him like like really really seeking i don't think folks really knew like when i was in atlanta when i got hecka skinny like i got skinny for real that's when i was spending time with god and that's because i wanted to like i i wanted to like i was you know what I'm saying i was going through with it for real and i was just every time i woke up i went to my closet and started praying and stuff like every time i woke up went to my closet i'll come back do a smoothie or something, you know what I'm saying? Come, then go back in. I'll just be going back and forth, back and forth. Because I was trying to realize, like, bro, is you, like, is you really real? Like, is, is what my mom was talking about really real? Like, you really talk. And then one time, I just, I ain't going to tell you how to full test more because that's like, a, you know what I'm saying, another day. But one time, I just went in the closet. I, you know what I'm saying? I threw my phone out, out the door. I threw the Bible out the door, Bible app. And I was like, God, I ain't leaving till I hear your voice. And that's like, that's, I, I was straight up. I say, I told him, I said, God, I'm not leaving till I hear your voice. I need to know that you real. Like, I'm, like, I'm confused right now. I don't know what's, woo, woo. Yeah, that's the first time I, I ever heard God's voice. And I know it might sound crazy to y'all or crazy this person, crazy this person. But I, I say that because I used to look at the person talking about this crazy myself. And it's coming from me, like Phil Kofer. <laughs> I'm on YouTube talking about this right now. I don't think I would ever do this. So it's coming from me, you know what I'm saying? And first time I heard God's voice, like, it wasn't even on no, like, I was happy to hear it. I was like, yo, like, I was scared. You know what I'm saying? I ran out the closet, like, I was scared. It wasn't no, like, 
God dang, like thank you for talking. It wasn't on none of that. It went and it's real deal when the people say it speak. It's not like it's like a now everybody say this, but it's like a I won't even say it, it's like a whisper. It's a whisper, bro, but it's like on some like like you hear it in your soul. Like I don't even know how to explain. I can't even really explain, dog. Y'all just gotta like that's God one of the things, like once you experience him for yourself, bro, it just it blow your mind. You just gonna be like, dang, this man really real. And just ever since then that bro, it's like everything just been coming blessing after blessing it's bigger than just blessings but behind all this stuff bro it's like i know i got a lot of material stuff and i know i got a lot of stuff and y'all probably look at me like man feel rich or feel do this feel got this feel got that and like that's cool bro I, you know what i'm saying like i ain't trying to be i ain't gonna like i said i love material stuff bro. i ain't gonna sit here and lie to y'all and say i don't love expensive stuff i don't love you know what i mean like <laughs> things that's on this earth like I, I love a lot of stuff you know what i'm saying and well, I like a lot of stuff. I guess you can't really say love. Well, I don't know. Yeah, <laughs> I like a lot of stuff on this earth. But I'm saying like if y'all like my heart behind this stuff, bro, like even when I was praying with God, my heart behind this like YouTube stuff and all this, like I want to help people out. Like that's my main thing, whatever this thing. Like I want to like, I pray, like I prayed. I say, God, I, I'm trying to change the world. That's how I'm coming. Like I don't care what I got to go through. I know it's going to be hard. You know what I'm saying? I know it's going to be stuff where I, I got to fight my flesh. I got to fight temptation. I know it's going to be battles. And, uh, you know what I'm saying? I know people going to, you know what I'm saying, look at me crazy. I know people going to think Phil went Hollywood or Phil did this. You know what I'm saying? Did that. I know I'm built for it. That's why I be thinking, like, he ain't just picked me for no reason. So he know I'm built for it. So, like I said, I ain't saying it's going to be easy. I ain't saying it's going to be this. I ain't going to feel that. But, like, <laughs> this position I'm in, like, like, a lot of stuff that come with doing stuff for God. Like, you're going to have to go through all that stuff. It ain't just going to be no cakewalk. It ain't, that's not how I go. You know what I'm saying? God is definitely good, and God going to help you through a lot of stuff, but it definitely is not no cakewalk. You know what I'm saying? Just speaking for real, bro. Every time I just be thinking on, like, I be doing stuff, but just cooking, you know what I'm saying? Cooking or just making, uh, like, just doing this and stuff. I just be straight thinking, bro. Just everything I done been through. Like, I, I'm, I'm, I'm here doing YouTube, bro. Like, I'm here on YouTube, and in two years, we ran up 100,000, bro. That's how God worked. Yeah, I don't, like... I don't think folk really take in, like, <laughs> like <laughs> every time somebody asks me, you be like, dang, bro, you ran that up fast. Every time I say it, I say it every time. I don't say nothing else but that. I say, bro, straight God. I don't, and I ain't saying no corny business or none of that. It's just straight God. I can't even, I can't even sit here and say, man, I would grind it because I wouldn't even grind it like that. I was just putting out videos because I love to do it. And I'm saying, I wouldn't even grind it like that. Grinding with working out, but grinding with YouTube, nah, I wouldn't even taking it too serious like that for real. And again, I'm going to tell y'all my testimony way down the line, but I already know what he want me to do. Like, I already know what he 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 want me to do. And he, he been waiting on me for the longest. And that's how God works. He pick out the most, like, the people who just don't even look like they can get picked. Like, <laughs> He, look, he pick out the people who don't even look like they can get pinned. And it's on some like he picked me, and I'm the one saying, "Whoa, whoa, like slow down, bro." Like you feel me? Like you know my past. You know what I just like you feel me? And he like, yeah. I said I chose you. And I'm still rambling, like bro. You know what I just like? You know what I've been through? Like you know what I just like what? Like you feel me? Like the way I talk? Like you know what I'm saying? Like bro, it's like he's still saying, "Yeah, I know," and I chose you, and it's not even like. Sevenfold, bro. That's how I'm going to end this right here. Sevenfold. We still going, bro. We, I'm finna watch. This is what I love to do. You know what I'm saying? Like, I love to do this. And I know, like, it's a lot of stuff I done wrote and jot down. It's like, it's steady coming, bro. But I ain't I ain't trying to settle for less. I ain't trying to settle for, oh, I'm cool with YouTube. Right? Like, the, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm cool with it right now. I don't got to do, nah. I'm trying to change the world. I'm saying, and I want y'all to know that too, cause I ain't coming different than that. I'm letting y'all know right now, and this go down the line. I ain't doing nothing for views. I ain't, you know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna do this so I can, oh yeah, I gotta do it like this to be like this other person so I can get views, or I gotta do it this way to do it. Nah, I'm coming like me. I'm being me. Um, you know I mean? I'm standing on that, and I ain't, you feel me? Like, that's just how I'm coming. Like, he ain't. And I'm telling y'all that because that's that what it is. You know what I'm saying? I ain't I ain't getting in that circle how this person got to do this to blow up or this person got to do this to blow up. Nah, I ain't I ain't going. I ain't doing that, bro. I ain't on that type of time. I ain't. I'm telling y'all that right now. I ain't doing that, bro. I know God standing right beside me with his hand on my shoulder right now, <laughs> saying, "Yeah, <laughs> he the one." <laughs> is you crazy? 
Nah, he ain't saying that, but <laughs> yeah, bro, that's 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 you know what I'm saying that's how I'm coming, man. I ain't I ain't being less. I ain't yeah, bro. <laughs> like I'm not like yeah. I already know it. I already know it. So for anybody that's doing YouTube, you know what I mean. Don't change up your day or do this, do that. You know what I'm saying. Do whatever you doing. You know what I mean. Be you. You know what I'm saying. Don't yeah yeah. Do that. Let God do the rest, and you see what. That what we coming. You see where we at right now. I'm being me, and we had a hundred thousand subscribers. That's how God work. I ain't doing. Yeah, you feel me? Before I go to that pizza, cause I ain't ate yet. You did. It's like, it's like you know we be having way more than you know, bro. It's like it's done. It's like we should be grateful every time. Bro. trust nobody because you got a problem with trust yourself Amen. and maybe people can't trust you and you putting that off on everybody as a man thinking in his heart so is that's why you got to be careful what you think because as a man thinking so the people may not be the problem it may be you I just hey I just putting it out there I'm a hitch. Uh, you hurt? Yeah.